Hey everybody, it's Darla here, and I just wanted to kind of go over some items I made for Halloween that I'm going to put in my Etsy store, because I feel like uh, somebody may like these. These are nice additions to add to a bar, I think, uh, or just on a shelf all year round, if that's the kind of stuff you like. Now the first thing is I have two of these. They're little, uh, I made them like little candle holders. Or you could put like a little succulent in there or a little plant. You know, whatever you want to put in there. This bottom part was a little flute, champagne flute. And this little rim here is a little glass dish that I had picked up at Goodwill or the antique store, I don't know which, but they were little glass, I think they were little coasters, to be truthfully. But I glued that on the top, and then I put a little glass dish on the top of that. I spray painted them all black, and then I did accent with some silver paint. Now, I used these this Halloween, and I had uh, fake candles in them. But you could put a little greenery. Let's get a little greenery here. Oops. So see, you could put a little greenery on the top of it and have it like a little flower vase. Uh, you know, I would get something that would kind of be shorter. But, and I do have two of them. And I'm going to have those on my Etsy store. If you're interested. I also did this. Uh, this is a wine bottle. It was uh, blueberry wine. So see the bottle is dark. I uh, made these bats from a mold. I made my skull from a mold. mold. This here was already on there. And uh, I have mold in clay. This is air dry clay embellishments on the side. And then I had a, you know, just an old chain with some little odds and ends on it. It's got a lock and keys and I thought that looked good on there. So I glued that to the top. It's got a little cord. Now you could put a candle in here. You could leave it just like this. Uh, you could put a little flower in there, whatever you wanted. But it, I, paint, I spray painted it, uh, or no, I painted it purple, because that's my favorite color. And it's this cool, like, iridescent purple, and then I added uh, gold, uh, it, it might have been buff, rub and buff, or something like that. So I put it all over the bats, and but there's a close-up of the, you know, I think this would look good on a bar, <laughs> you know, with your liquor. Because, you know, liquor could be dangerous. So, you know, if you just like this stuff. But it's nice. And I'll have this on my Etsy store. My last item is this right here. This here was a juice bottle. Got some kind of juice in it, as you see. I want to finish the bottoms of these. And I think this was an ornament. I've got clay, dry clay embellishments around the rim. Uh, this here, like tree type thing I made there, I did that with the glue gun and just kind of put it on there. As you see, it's got undertones of this like turquoise green. Uh, I put a net on there to kind of give it like a eerie, you know, spider webby or just an eerie texture to it. And uh, But I got the gold tones on top, uh, the turquoise underneath with uh, greens and rust and browns at the bottom. And once again, I think this is a nice little jar or you know, to put up on your shelf. Yeah, so. 
that's the things that I'm going to put on my Etsy store. So if you're interested, you can look at them. I also have this right here that I got at Goodwill. Uh, and I think uh, somebody brought it to my attention that I haven't really done a how-to video when I uh, do this stuff. Because usually I just go in there and I start working. I don't think about filming. And I'm not really used to, uh, you know, filming <laughs> me making stuff. But I think I'm going to take this little vase. It's glass. And it's got these ridges on it. And I've been looking at Pottery Barn. And there's quite a few uh, vases like this shaped like this with this texture so i'm going to do it uh on a video how i make this look like a old clay container so that'll be coming up in uh, hopefully in the next uh week or so a couple weeks maybe you know it's we're in november now and so uh hopefully i can get this done before it Thanksgiving. But my other items, I'll be taking pictures of them and I'll put them on my Etsy store. If you're interested, go to my Etsy store at Sugar Made Creations and check out my items. All right, guys, thanks for, for your time. And if you like this little video, just let me know. Holler at me. Give me a thumbs up. I'll talk to you later. Bye.